Hey guys, what's up? So, I've always wanted to get my groove on in Minecraft, and I, you know, never have time to, you know, be dancing in Minecraft because I'm always out mining or I'm probably building a house, but, you know, sometimes I just feel like going out, maybe going to a club and, you know, dancing with people that I know. Anyways, guys, it just happened. So, I went to a club and I had a blast. I was grooving everywhere. Anyways guys, this mod is called a Grooves Monster mod for Minecraft 1.2.5. Basically what this mod does is it now adds in a cool animation to your monsters and mobs. Even a player from a multiplayer server will experience this and their heads will be bobbing around as if they're beating to a groove. This mod works both single player and it works for multiplayer. Even some mobs from mods will get their groove on as well. So if you install mo creatures, most likely the bears and all that other stuff will be dancing as well. Alright, so most of all animals will start to dance and will get their groove on, such as the villagers, look at them, they're grooving out in their little pen over here, and we have ourselves some sheeps over here grooving out, you'll notice that their heads keep on going uh, in the same motion, all mobs uh, start to turn and twist their heads in the same motion. They're all going to be dancing to the same groove, but check out the skeletons, here they are, they're dancing, and we have ourselves some mushrooms, some cows, and we have ourselves a villager right here, I don't know what he's doing here. And it looks like there's a zombie over there trying to kill him. <laughs> it looks like he's running away. And then we have ourselves some creepers over here dancing to the groove. And we have ourselves some pigs and chickens. Some of the chickens were laying eggs, but remember that baby animals do not uh, shake their heads or any of that stuff, so they can't get their groove on when they're young. And we have ourselves some skeletons over there running away. And then we have ourselves some pigmen. And these pigments are getting their groove on even in the nether. We come over here, we have ourselves some cave spiders and spiders, and they also get their groove on too. I don't know what type of music they're into, but uh, maybe it's some good stuff. We have ourselves some blaze over here, and they're just getting their groove on in the nether as well. We have ourselves some wolves, and they look pretty dark, I'm not sure what's going on. And they're getting their groove on with some ocelots, and yeah, that's pretty cool. We have ourselves some zombies over here as well, getting their groove on, and we have ourselves uh, endermen. And right over here, we have ourselves iron golems, and they get their groove on as well. If we come over here, here's the list of mobs that could not get their groove on. We have ourselves the squids, the ghasts, the silverfish, the slime, the baby animals, the magma cubes, and the ender dragon. These are the mobs that cannot get their groove on. And you guys are probably wondering what about the uh, snow golem. Well, apparently when I start to craft myself a snow golem, my game crashes, so I can't show you him getting his groove on. Maybe it's just a server, maybe it's GSL shaders, I'm not sure what it is. But let me go ahead and craft the snow golem and show you that my game crashes. Yep, there we go. I'm not sure if you can still listen to my voice, but uh, my game crashed. All the mobs seem to be escaping from their pens. It's really funny, and I forgot to review one other mob. This is called the Victor 1260. He's just chilling here, shooting his arrows, and you'll notice his head is going up and down. Whoa, what's going on over here? The whole, my, my pen is destroyed. What's going on? Dogs are getting out. Ocelots. What? Who started this? So yeah guys, uh, that's basically what the mod's about. This mod is really awesome. Apparently, these mobs just totally went against me and they started breaking out the last minute. I don't know, I don't understand how this all started. I believe it was that one. I think he's the head guy that started all this uh, conflict and all this fire and all this bad stuff. Look, I'm even on fire. Alright guys, if you guys are still interested in this mod, you want to know how to install this mod. This mod works not only single player, but it works for multiplayer. This mod is really easy to install. We do not need mod loader or any of the other requirements so let's go ahead and see how to install this mod 
Alright, so let's go ahead and install this mod. This mod is really easy to install, so we shouldn't have any errors. But the first thing I'm going to want to do, of course, before installing this mod is to go here to Options and Force Updating Game. The reason why I'm going to Force Updating Game is because I have mods currently installed. If you guys have mods currently installed, I always recommend to back them up because you're never too sure if this mod is compatible with any of your mods. If it's not compatible, you will get a black screen and you won't be happy. So Options, Force Update, and Login to download on a brand new Minecraft.jar in which we're going to mod. I'm going to go ahead and leave this updating. I'm going to go ahead and minus my browser. Now what we're going to do is go into my description. It's going to take you to my website and you're going to get the Groove Monsters uh, mod. It's going to be located in the description. Go ahead and get it and drag it here to the desktop in which you can see it better. There's no need for Minecraft Forge or Mod Loader. This mod is just a standalone installation. Now let's go ahead and do this. I'm going to go here to start. Search program file. I'm going to type in percent app data percent and for windows xp users you should see here run and you run percent after percent and it should take you up here to the roaming folder click on the roaming folder and you should see dot minecraft in the very top you're going to go into your dot minecraft folder you're going to see bin resources save everything else go into your bin folder before you open up your minecraft dot jar in which we're going to mod you have to make sure you have your minecraft game closed here's my minecraft game that i just forced updated you have to exit off your minecraft game before installing any mod so exit off your minecraft game now you're going to right click your minecraft.jar that's located in your bin folder, open with WinRAR or any 7-zip opener. So you're going to open up your minecraft.jar with WinRAR. Open that up and move it aside. The first thing you have to do of course before installing any mods is to delete metaimp. You have to delete metaimp. So right click metaimp and delete files. Say yes and delete metaimp. Now metaimp is gone now we can continue. Open up the Grooves Monsters, double click, move it aside. You're going to hide all the files from the Grooves Monsters and simply drag it all into the minecraft.jar site and replace press ok and you are done that's basically how to install a mod all you have to do is just highlight the files and simply drag it over it's just like installing too many items it's a really easy mod to install i'm not sure how you guys get black screens maybe you didn't delete meta imp anyways let me go ahead and go to single player and check out if the mod worked apparently uh, i just got myself another black screen maybe i was trying to craft myself a snow golem and i was trying to do that in single player but my just game freezes all the time i'm not sure if that's a bug but uh, apparently uh, snow golems will crash your game and it really sucks. Let me go ahead and go into a different world that doesn't have a snow golem and see if it works. Alright, so I'm in a different world. Now let me go ahead and spawn myself a uh, ocelot. So I'm going to get my ocelot out here and see if his head starts to move up and down. No, it's running away from me so let me go ahead and spawn a different mob. Let's spawn ourselves a sheep. And there we go. So the sheep is... Uh, moving its head in the groove. If you would look at your inventory in survival, it will show your character uh, grooving as well. Or if you press F5, you will notice that your character is grooving. Alright guys, so that's basically it. This mod is really awesome. Hopefully you guys enjoy this mod. It just adds in a grooving feature. So when you guys are listening to your music while playing Minecraft, which most of us actually do, uh, you guys could be grooving with the monsters with your music. I'm not even sure. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and catch you guys later. Thank you guys for all your support. See you around.